This channel is supported by Truefire. Truefire is an online library of lessons from some of my favorite players. There's thousands of lessons on there. You can use the promo code JNC40 to get 40% off of any of their courses. sent me emails leading up to the birth of my daughter carbon fiber style guitars eventually I got back to them uh, when they were asking about the launch of their carbon fiber x3 pro mini 
I was pleasantly surprised with that guitar. Did a comparison with it. Obviously on an acoustic guitar, the tone wood is probably more important, you have to imagine, than on an electric guitar. So when they suggested that they're building an electric guitar and would I like to check one out, um, this is a sponsored video, as I've just alluded to. I said, yeah, sure. So a nice case. And um, this is the white model, obviously. And uh, a really futuristic looking thing. Kind of got those supreme type vibes to it um, as in you know that brand this is what the guitar looks like when you get it out of the box uh, I did have my suitably large knife to do that with my first sort of 10 minutes with it have been pleasant surprise you really never know what to expect you know if someone says I've got this um, carbon fiber guitar do you want to check it out it's a, a bit of a you know, you never know what to expect. The acoustic I really liked, um, but this is quite a different beast, quite a sleek style of electric guitar, really. Um, and I guess importantly, quite resonant. unplugged as well which is a, a bonus really because that is kind of what can make a guitar kind of a bit more happening and I guess part of that might be that we've got this rather awesome neck through design when you turn this thing on essentially this is a, a built-in speaker here And we've got a normal pickup selector. Zero fret here. get to feedback as well which is actually kind of a bit of a feature not necessarily a bug got delay on this one Bluetooth speaker with effects and kind of amp tones but what I want to also want to try and do is just plug it in um, like a normal guitar and you know ignore some of the other features can we just play this like a normal guitar and what does it sound like just to show you something of what you do with the app you connect to your specific Novo Go which I've now got turned on Then you kind of got ability to change various things. You've got the mixer section where you can change guitar volume, Bluetooth volume, speaker volume, monitor volume, and all that stuff and line out. 
you've also got the ability to change our each tone so i just went in and kind of and that's what we're using here the tower go into edit you can see you've got a full kind of chain we've got the amp equalizer modulation noise reduction delay and reverb and we can turn those on or off deluxe clean or 100 distortion amp choices um, but you know two decent amp choices and you got presets and then yeah you can experiment with all of this stuff um, this is kind of the lead tone that So kind of a useful sort of house guitar, I think, um, that you don't mind taking various places where temperature changes and that sort of thing might happen. Bends are not coming off super easy at the moment. Um, the one gripe that I have with it is the tuners, I would say. Uh, what was really nice about the X3 Pro Mini was they were kind of a clone of like some really nice Goto tuners. These are not I don't think quite the same quality so that's kind of one gripe if I have one uh, the E string kind of slipped out of it and then it wasn't possible to get it back in so I've just restrung that but as a sort of practice instrument uh, we've got a series parallel split for that um, kind of works <laughs> alternative to this sort of thing might be to get a headphone amp and and plug into your ordinary sort of guitar that you don't mind taking out but it does actually play quite a lot better than um, some of the really cheap guitars that you can get so I think certainly a, a, an option <laughs> yeah liking the way that it was sounding with helix native and so that's a nice option that even if you're out of charge you could still use it as your basic kind of um just a normal guitar without a headphone output and stuff like that so even without the bluetooth and app stuff it works as a, as a guitar and even unplugged <laughs> It's doing good things i think let me know your thoughts in the comments would you ever play a carbon fiber guitar like to know your thoughts this is the second one that i've played the parker nightfly had a carbon fiber neck that was quite nice but interesting to see that carbon fiber can either be a super super high-end kind of instrument type thing or even 
at this slightly more budget friendly end like this Enya. So thanks to Enya for sponsoring this video and donating to the uh, Nappy Fund. And uh, yeah, a really cool guitar, I think.